Andy Murray will be looking to make a deep run at Wimbledon having won two challenger events on grass. Andy Murray is inspired to keep playing by Novak Djokovic, and getting a good night's sleep away from his four kids, John McEnroe has claimed. The Scot, 36, will play his 15th Wimbledon next week after climbing back into the world's top 40 for the first time since his two hip surgeries. Murray has spoken this week about going out on his terms and wanting to play for a couple more years, despite calls on social media for him to quit. But BBC analyst McEnroe said, instead of focusing on the negative, they should probably focus on the positive because this guy loves the game as much as he does. He's put so much time and effort and his heart and soul into trying to come back to be a top player and it's been slower than he wanted. And I am sure it's been unbelievably frustrating. It's been a long, hard road. I am sure he's been inspired by Novak because they are the same age and look at this guy who looks like he's 25. But I can also tell you that having had six kids of my own, sometimes, a little sleep is not a bad thing if you play a few tournaments when you head out for a tournament or two. So he's got four kids, and that'll keep you up at night. So, you know, having that little mix is probably a good thing. Murray has won two challenger events on grass, his wife Kim and four children were at Nottingham to see his second victory, but he has failed to get past the third round in his last two appearances without a seating. I think certainly his best chance is at Wimbledon, said seven-time Grand Slam winner McEnroe. He understands the nuances of grass better than anyone. It's gonna depend on his draw. If he plays Djokovic in the first round, I am pulling for him to do something. I certainly think he's better than most. I put him in the top dozen players that understand what it takes to compete and do well on grass. So from that alone, if he gets a couple breaks here and there and gets going. Who knows what could happen? Winning it, that's a big ask, but you never know. British no one Cam Norrie reached the semi-finals last year before losing to champion Djokovic. The two had a more heated meeting in Rome when the Serb was furious when Nori hit him with a smash, and the world number 13 then complained Djokovic had kept him waiting before the match. Is there potential for a grudge match at Wimbledon? McEnroe asked. I think Nori would hope so. I know Novak made a few comments. Like he was being disrespectful. I'm just generally impressed that Nori has done so well and has really maximized his potential. He should be very proud of that. I wouldn't worry about Djokovic if I was him. I'd worry about some of the other guys, those who have moved past him in the rankings. We'll see how that plays out. But I'm sure for him he'd love to play Djokovic in the semis. That means he's in the semis.